Hi, it's Michael Taylor from trackworthy.com and today we are taking delivery of our new 2017 Volkswagen Golf GTI. Brand new car, hasn't left the showroom, has something like 20 kilometers on it and we're going to be driving this car for the next several months and uh, let you know how it performs, how we like it, our nitpicks if there are any, I'll give you just an overall sense of what it's like to own and operate this car, use it as a daily driver. We've chosen the Golf GTI because it does have a reputation for being one of the most useful sports cars around. Um, we have opted for the five-door version. We've added a few packages to this, so it's got, um, it's got the Audubon package. Um, to be honest with you, I'm not exactly sure what's in there, but amongst other things, it has a sunroof, full leather interior. Um, but as I said, we will be giving you updates as we go along. And for those of you who are regular viewers of Trackworthy and our YouTube channel and our website, um, we've been driving the Subaru WRX STI for the last several months. And uh, it was a great car to drive. As you can see, I'm wearing my Subaru sweater in honor of the Hikari Edition STI that we had. But we have now uh, moved on from that and uh, we'll be trying this car. We considered getting the Golf R, but felt that um, two-wheel drive with a sunroof and would just be a little bit more um, user-friendly for all of us. And uh, we also considered getting a five-speed manual. Instead, we've opted for the DSG. Again, makes the car much more useful for everybody who's gonna be driving it. We got it in silver, as you can see, with a black interior. And we think it really does a good job of setting off the highlights of the Golf GTI red around the car. Um, standard rims that come with the car. So we'll tell you what it's like to own and operate, give you a sense of uh, maintenance costs, should there be any. Um, we'll let you know if we have any problems with the car. I'm sure we won't. Volkswagen make great products. Set aside the diesel issue. This is not a diesel. This is a petrol. Uh, so just a regular gasoline powered engine, obviously. Stay tuned. We'll give you lots of updates as we go. Lots of videos and drive carefully.